Hello everybody, Rob Longo here with the Foster Law Office's player of the game, Heidi Mann, after what was a crazy 81-79 win um, over Teal earlier today at the Matheny Fieldhouse. It seemed like you guys were in pretty good control, Heidi, and then it kind of slipped away, and at the last second it ended up you know, being the proverbial crunch time. What was the mindset in those last couple of seconds? Uh, I mean, the last couple of seconds, everything was fired up. We shouldn't have gotten that position in the first place, so then, I mean... Obviously, you saw them step their game up. There was, I mean, it was just tight, tight defense. So the last minute was, okay, I'm supposed to sink the free throws, and then we've got to be on them like glue. You ended up with 21 points, but there was a lot of hot shooting from everybody at the beginning in the first half. It seemed like it was almost a three-point competition in a sense between the two teams. Uh, how much do you guys rely on that outside shooting, and was that part of the game plan today with that size that Teal has? Not necessarily part of the game plan, um, but that's certainly something we can utilize. So when it's on, why not? We've got our shooters this year. More of the game plan is we want to assist. We want to move the ball, and when it's that wide open and our shooters are on, we'll use it. Now, you are a senior. You reached the 1,000-point plateau last season, climbing up the ranks in the all-time scoring list here at Geneva, uh, I believe eighth all-time right now. You know, how long – and, again, how, how much are those personal accolades a factor, if they are a factor at all, and, and what's it like to be known that you'll be one, you will be one of the best players that Geneva has seen scoring-wise here uh, when your four years are over? I hadn't thought of it that way before. I didn't know I was eighth. Um, I, it never it never feels like like I'm scoring that much. Um, I've got a team who does a lot of that for me, and so either I'm kicking it out and they're finishing, or they're finding me on good passes. So I love the team because it's so much. We're not we're not selfish players. So that's more of what I'm thinking about than I guess what number I am. <laughs> Now, the focus on that team aspect, you know, you guys have gone through some tough times the past couple years that you've been here, but now you guys are fighting for a playoff spot. You're, you're almost all but do have a playoff spot. Uh, you're almost looking at a home playoff game, too. What's it been like kind of seeing this program progress over the past couple years over your time and finally seeing success during your senior year? It's a huge thing. Um, I mean, it's been tiring at times, uh, but it's been a huge blessing that the Lord has shown us growth every single year. So first year coming in really hard. Second year, you know, we see something start happening. We change things around. Third year, it seemed like, okay, we're going to turn the corner. We have this play under our belt. And now finally, I think we're where we thought we might be last year, just to have a solid base. We've had more continuity. Um, so it's it's been a great process. Coach Wynn has always taught us to celebrate the little things, and now we get to celebrate a little bit bigger while we know how to celebrate what's been going on on an individual level. Heidi Mann, 21 points, a team high, and an 81-79 win over Teal today at the Matheny Fieldhouse.